Hello and welcome everyone to another episode. So, I think this is what, 16? Yeah, we'll, we'll go with 16. So, uh, yeah, we need a rover on the moon base. Moon base beta rover. Um, yeah, I, I kind of just need a very small rover relatively for what it's going to be doing. Uh, yeah, I, I'm not going to be you know, traveling super far distances with this thing or, you know, doing anything too crazy. So, yeah, I figured we might as well just jump right into it. I'll get this rover built and launched, and hopefully it doesn't give me any problems. Now, uh, yeah, uh, usually I always have problems with rovers. It's great, especially getting them there. It's like the most, like, unbelievably hard process ever. Uh, all the other rovers you guys have seen in my other episodes. Yeah, they fought me the whole way. It's amazing. So, uh, yeah. So I just, like, was, uh, I, um, I'm a Cracked reader. I don't know if you, a lot of you guys have heard about Cracked.com or ever been to that website, but it's an amazing website. And I was just reading uh, an article on there, and I didn't even realize or know about it, but THQ is out of business. They filed for bankruptcy. Um, I, it's just surprising me with a lot of these game companies now. It's just like, you know, it's almost like the crash, the video game, video game crash from years ago. I mean, it's just like the whole market is dying. Uh, ooh, I better fix that. Uh, not not in a bad way, but, you know, I a lot of people play, like, you know, Call of Duty and stuff like that, and I have nothing against these games. Like, they're okay, but I, I'm not a hero mode fighter kind of guy. I would rather, you know, I stopped pretty much playing shooters after uh, they started implementing all the achievement stuff and... It just got a little too silly for me. I, I'm not, you know, like, I don't need a game to tell me I'm a good player. I, if, I, if I'm a good player, I know. You know, it's just kind of silly to me, that whole achievement thing. So, uh, yeah. Uh, this rover isn't going to be, you know, it's going to be a standard rover like most of my other ones. I'm trying to do it with the least amount of parts as possible. And you can see I'm putting on these big battery packs to, uh, you know, so I don't have like 15 of the little ones on there to, you know, or whatever. You know, this is equivalent to five of the small ones, so I would have 20 of them on there. I don't know where I got 15 from. Just pulling numbers out of my... So, yeah, I, I'm just surprised THQ is gone. Like, you know, I, I'm not a avid player or you know I didn't really play Saints Row or any of those games I never really you know I watched like the Let's Plays for them with uh I forgot who was even playing them I think it was Yogg's Cast or somebody but it you know it's they're not you know THQ really wasn't yeah it's just surprising to me it's not like they were a small company is the, the part that's kind of shocking uh but yeah, I guess another one bites the dust. I, as far as game developers are concerned, it's not that I stick with indie, you know, or I support, you know, I, I'm not like gonna say, oh yeah, well, you know, what is it, Squad Games or whatever it is, is the best game company alive or, you know, whatever it is. I, I just kind of play whatever is good. And, you know, in the recent years, I, I have to say that not a lot of the games have been the quality that I'm looking for. I, it's just, you know, when you look at Minecraft, it's such a simple game, yet it was, like, amazing. The game was just absolutely, it's so, and it's not, it wasn't even, like, a ground-breaking game, like, where, it, with, uh, you know, something that really hasn't been done before. I mean, it, it's somewhat, you know, to me, the game, like, when I used to explain it to my friends when I first started playing it, I just was like, yeah, it's kind of like if you like to play Legos. So, uh, but, you know, it's just a lot of the indie developers now are releasing games that are just, the quality is just spot on. I mean, you know, they're, you know, this game is in uh, Alpha, and I find playing this game ten times more rewarding and ten times 
like 10 times better and you know it's not even a complete game yet so it's just like to me the options are endless where this game's gonna go i mean i'm almost hoping that it kind of blows up like minecraft does in a sense i know this game still isn't as popular as uh you know it should be uh but you know i'm hoping for the future it's gonna be bright for this game I, you can already tell a little bit that this game is gaining popularity over, you know, just leaps and bounds. It's just an absolute amazing thing. I mean, it's like a machine that is growing daily. It, it's just the weirdest thing. But So, yeah, I figured I'd tell you guys that, you know, about THQ. I, I just still, I can't believe that they're gone. Um, you know, it's like... Capcom and all these other com all these other ones, you know, it's just like, when are they going to go? Not that I don't like Capcom. But, you know, it's just like, you know, the makers of Street Fighter would be gone. It's just like, you know, try explaining that to somebody. Uh, years from now, they're like, yeah. So who made Street Fighter? Oh. I never even heard of these people. Um, but, yeah. I've, so, with any rover design and construction, I still have to thank that commenter because I probably wouldn't have thought this by myself with the whole thermal gen inside the uh, the rover. Um, yeah, you, you saved me a lot of time. Uh, but yeah, this is a basic rover design. Um, this will be. Hopefully, if I don't mess it up in any kind of way, uh, this will be the rover for the uh, moon base, basically. That's just going to take care of all the function of the moon base, everything as far as moving the parts around and, you know, just construction. I'm probably not going to land another one, not unless if this one's just absolutely horrible and I didn't construct it correctly, but... Yeah, there you go. It's basic rover. Uh, I might as well launch it. I did not time this episode, so... Oh, I better rename this, too, before I hit the save button. Ew. Ah, that works. I don't like to keep the names long. But, um, what's any other news? Um, uh, I going, my classes start tomorrow. Uh, well, I don't know, maybe when I release this video, I'll probably already be in class. But, um, yeah, it's, this Monday would be like the start of my classes. And I'm still, I don't know if I mentioned this before, but yeah, I'm going to still upload videos. There just might be a slight delay compared to the most of my videos that I release, and wow, those struts are messed up. I should have, yeah, I, that's the one thing I always forget. Uh, let's see, I'll just throw on some struts real quick, and we'll get back to moon launch. Come on. Yeah, as you can see, I play with no mods. I mean, I always mention this, I don't like mods at all. I'm just not a fan of using mods to play the game and everything else it's just kind of a personal preference if you guys don't like it um you know just don't watch i guess or something i i'm just not a fan of using something to make the game easier in a sense you know if i'm playing a game i'm playing it because i enjoy it not because i want it to be easy uh I think I could just leave that one there. It's not going to be a problem. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I always try to aim for, like, you know, a specific time in my episodes. So, I, you know, some of them, you, you guys can see my last episode was a little bit longer than the normal ones. I, if you guys like that, um, I'll do more of them that way. But, I mean, you know, I'm not, like, a... You know, like I said, I don't really like watching moon launches, and I don't know how you guys are when it comes to playing, or watching, I should say, uh, if you...
don't care about seeing moon launches, if you want to see moon launches, I, I, I don't really know. I don't know why these are atta aren't attaching either. That's weird. Um, but yeah, so school and all kinds of crazy things, and uh, yeah, it's just one long silly process. That school, I, I, I don't want to go back. You know, I'm, I'm a little bit old to be going back in a sense, but I mean, a lot of you guys will be like, oh my god. You know, I'm not like, yeah, I'm 25, so, or well, 24, uh, almost 25. Uh, but it's just, uh, you know, it, it kind of sucks, but, you know, I'm kind of happy in the same sense. So, uh, this looks like it's got enough struts to me. Yeah, it's good enough. Let's go. Hurry up! But yeah, I'm not, uh... Yeah, it's not that, like, I'm just starting school. I've been going for, uh, a while now, but it's, uh... You know, like, I work full-time, I go to school part-time, and so I try to pack in the credits where I can, and I don't, I don't really have any leeway when it comes to working, so it's like, you know three days out of the week, I'm going to be basically waking up, going to work, then going to school, and then getting home at basically like 10 o'clock at night, and eating until I uh, pass out, basically. And then waking up and doing the same thing all over again, and then, you know, you got the homework. It's all going to be one really excitingly annoying process. But, I know, my hopes are high, so that's that's all that really matters. I just, um, you know, I gotta keep those grades up. So the videos, you know, I'll try to, like, I'm thinking more of recording, like, three or four episodes in one day and then slowly releasing them or something or whatever. I, I want to keep you guys updated, and I figure I'll let you know that the frequency isn't going to be the same as it's been, but... I'm going to try to keep it that way, so, I mean, you guys could just keep tuning in, and, uh, you know, I'll keep my fingers crossed that everything will work out the way I want it. So, I think I'm going to get this in orbit, and then I will switch it off to another episode. I mean, I don't really know if you guys want to watch me launch and land and everything else. You know, I, I try to cut out the launching and landing thing. So, you know, I, to me, it's just boring, so. And also, my frame rate really isn't the best, especially on launch, so. Um, yeah, so, I, you know, I'm thinking about playing a couple other games, too, just for fun and recording them, uh. You know, I, I like to play a lot of, like, the real-time strategy games and stuff like that. Like, uh, I, I mean, you know, like, Ages of Empires was, like, one of my favorite games ever. Like, I, uh, I wasn't, like, a really good player. Like, I wasn't, like, you know, one of those people that could, like, kill you within three seconds of, uh, like, starting the game or something. But, you know, I was more of, like you know, the economy kind of guy, where I, I, I always saw the economy thing as being really cool, where, you know, you just boost your economy to insane levels, and, you know, like, with Civilization, and, um, what else, like, SimCity, i always been a fan of, like, a lot of the higher-end, like, Sim games and stuff, it's, the, to me, they're always, like, amazing, it's just fun stuff, but... I mean, if you guys would like to see stuff like that, I mean, I'll play it. I'm not the best player, so you guys will probably be, like, yelling at the screen the whole time. And, uh, yeah. I, I, what was another game? It was, like, Tropico. One of that, that was, like, one of the games that, like, I always saw, and I always, like, heard reviews about it, but I never played it because it just didn't seem like it was, a, like, a serious kind of game, in a sense. I mean, not like I'm a serious gamer, but... 
I just kind of saw it as like a uh, kind of like a joke game. It's like you know the um, what's his name? The it's like a porn game. I forgot the name of it, but it's like uh, it, what is it? I I can't even not. Mad Max comes to mind for some reason. I don't even think that's a freaking game. So, um, but it's like a uh, Leisure Suit Larry that game. Yeah, it always reminds me of like something like that. Um, but you know, I, I played that game. I bought it a while ago, and it seems kind of cool. I just couldn't really grasp the idea of what what I was supposed to do. Um, you know, I, I got the game to work, and I beat a few levels without trying, but. At the same time, I didn't really know what I was doing. I was just kind of like, oh, okay, so you do this, whatever. Um, but, yeah, yeah, you know, it's not like I'm into serious games now. I still love my shooters, but, you know, like I was saying before, I'm just not a fan of hero mode, like, um, you know, plowing through a oh, thousand people to kill, you know, somebody or something. It's just... it. It's not realistic to me. It's not fun, you know. You can see I still haven't gotten the solar module to the moon yet. I didn't even mess around with any of that um, as yet. I'm probably that will probably be the next episode. I'm not sure. So yeah, let's get this thing to the moon. Um, yeah, just a little bit more. I think it should be there we go what's that oh, perfect you know like you guys see me do this um you know like you know just lining up that maneuvering node like it's not like i um you know if you guys have seen my videos and stuff like that you know, out of like 20 videos of going to the moon and everything else, or to what, 25 videos now, I, I can't even, I don't even know how many videos I have now, it's just like insane, um, you know, lining up something like that, I mean, just like how I was just like, oh yeah, you just bring it over a little bit here, a little bit here, and then knowing pretty much how fast I need to go, or how fast I need to accelerate to, that takes a little bit of skill, as far as like, just knowing almost I'm gonna start my burn a little bit ahead of time this rocket is gonna die because I don't have much fuel left but I have plenty of fuel in the next stages so but yeah um if you guys want to see some Civ games or you know something like that I wouldn't mind recording stuff like that I'm just not a uh, I'm not, like, too big on recording certain... Like, Civ is kind of a boring game by itself. Not saying that it's a bad game. It's just more of, like, you have to be into civilization already in order to appreciate, like, like somebody playing it. So, if you don't understand the game already and how the mechanics are, then you just kind of are like, oh, so you're playing a game I've never played before? Oh, this is kind of boring. I don't really like watching this. Start my burn. Now this rocket does explode from time to time, so we'll see what happens. It explodes only because it's not stable, because there's nothing holding the stage, the blast, the the big stage on, which is actually out of fuel now. See you later. There we go. Now I can turn on SAS. Not right there, though. That would not be good. Um, yeah, so, yeah, Civilization, I was thinking about, and there's an old game called Rise of Nations that I kind of liked playing. Um, Ages of Empires. Uh, what else? Um, hmm. Maybe not, uh, you know, I'm like a little stumped right now. I, there's a lot of games I, I have, too. There's like, they even have like this Rome game. I forgot what it is exactly, but there's a lot of those like Rome-style civilization builder kind of games. 
and um that one i actually got kind of good at at one point and i could just like literally beat all the tutorials without or not the tutorials but the uh campaigns without even trying it was just that easy um and that was i bought off steam like years ago Ooh. That's what happens when you're not paying attention. Yeah, so I can fix this, whatever. Wait. Yeah, that works. Whatever. Not every not every moon launch goes the way I want it. Well the burn. Sometimes it's off by a little bit. You just gotta know how to fix it. That's it. So let's get this fixed. Um. That works. Trying to think. Um, I mean, I, Counter Strike Source is like my probably one of my number one favorite shooter games. But I kind of got a little upset with them when they added the achievements to that game. I'm just not a I'm not a fan of that stuff. Like, I just want to play my game. I don't really care too much about achievements and things like that. It's just not it doesn't appeal to me in any way. Like, if I I just don't feel I need to be um, rewarded for playing. Like, I understand that some people need some kind of a gratification you know and be told that they're good it's just like if you're good you know you're good all right that works perfect let's try this time acceleration because i remember last episode i was just kind of like whoosh, and i just shot right all the way there and uh yeah not good i, I almost ran into not good things I just love that the moon has like a million and a half things on it. It's all just like it's like one big giant glob of stuff. Every time you get close to it, you just see like all these little things everywhere on the the moon torch and moon base alpha and moon base beta and all these rovers and you got the moon ha uh, moon lab going around. I'm thinking about making a space station that goes around with a polar orbit. I thought that'd be really cool. We can give it like a little bit higher orbit, like uh, you know, 150 or something like that. It'll probably look really cool. So let's get this thing switched over to retrograde. I keep on thinking I have that huge stage on the back of this thing, so I have to turn on RCS to even move it. So, I'm gonna just gonna get this in orbit, and I think I'm just gonna land this off the uh, camera, just so um, I can save on time. I don't wanna, I don't wanna stretch this episode out super far for you guys. I know a lot of people don't really like watching insanely long episodes, so yeah. Orbit. Wow, that's going to be a little funky orbit. I never really adjust that because a lot of people will adjust that like way early. And I never really adjust that because I'm always thinking that my orbit's going to be alright. But that's always fix. You can, that's a quick fix. And you know what? I'm just going to... I was thinking about adjusting it, but nah. I'll just leave it. I'll leave it as is right now. Turn off SES. Let's go. As you can see, I'm doing really well on fuel. I don't. That's not all my fuel. I have like another stage, which is like considered to me as the landing stage. So whatever fuel is left over on this, I just don't even. I usually end up doing something really stupid and burning it all away. And I don't like. It's not that I uh, want to. I just don't care. Uh, okay, so that's good. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching, and, um, you know what? I'll probably, my next episode will be landing this thing, because I'm sure you guys would love to see a rover landing. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching. Um, if you like what I'm doing here, subscribe, and, uh, I'll see you next time.